What's up, everyone? Welcome to Power of Play with CJ. Well, it's official. Stefan Matteau's career in the Quebec Major Junior League with the Blainville Armada is over. He has been dismissed from the team uh, after he you know, quit the team. But, um, you know, what I want to focus on is what do the New Jersey Devils do from here? Obviously, you know, it ended pretty poorly. When your dad's an assistant coach and you quit a team, it's a bad message. Um, so I was thinking about this earlier. Henrik Samuels, another 2012 first rounder, played for Alfie, his old man, and um, in Sweden last year, then went over the Edmonton Oil Kings. That was a little bit different. Um, and Henrik had a tough adjustment playing against men on night in, night out basis. With I think it was, was with Moto. Then went to the Edmonton Oil Kings, played well, was a first round pick, and then um, you know has played very well this year for Edmonton. But going back to uh, to Matteau, you know, I think there's definitely some growing up to do. There was a great article in Sports Illustrated uh, by Alan Muir um, on, on the website about his past history transgressions. I'll read them. I'll do the liberty and read them off. 2010-2011, uh, eight game suspension for intent to injure after charging an unsuspecting opponent with development team. Seven game suspension for cross-checking an opponent in the face and abusing a linesman who tried to intervene. Right after he returned, Matteau was handed one game suspension for spearing an opponent in the groin. Um, then this year, that was 2010. 11-2012 with uh, the development team. And then this year, 2012-2013, uh, one game suspension here from behind, another game for being the aggressor in a fight, and then the Armada suspended him uh, internally to, uh, to send a message to him. It hasn't worked. Also received 10-minute 10 10 minute misconduct for a headshot in the Team USA's pre-World Junior Championship exhibition game, which pretty much knocked him off making that team. Like I said, played 17 games with the Devils this year. Got a look in the NHL. Not a lot of 18, 19-year-old kids can do, can get that look. Um, and he, he's pretty much blown it, you know. I mean, he's blown it with the Armada. He, you know, pretty much he has. And, uh, you know, now it's. I think he'll be in the AHL next year. I think he was going to be in the AHL anyway. I think he was really, he would have been better served being in the AHL down the stretch than up with the Armada. But, uh, you know, he's got to grow up. He really, like I said, New Jersey should have forfeited that 29th overall pick last year. Didn't do it. And, uh, you know, he's got some growing up to do. I think some time riding the bus in the AHL. And I, if, for the short term, I don't think he can join the AHL team because the junior agreement's going to be us. But if I'm the Devils, I bring him up. He doesn't play a game. He skates every day with the team. Sits in the press box and, you know, learns the ins and outs of the last week of the season, last, you know, six days of the season. That's what they got to do. I'm not going to reward the kid by giving him an HL ice time after he quit his junior team. It doesn't work that way. You know, what were they, Fox News with Sarah Palin? You know, if she quits the governor of Alaska, they give her an anchor job right away. Um, you know, I think that's the message you're, you're trying to send the kid. And, um, you know, hopefully it works out because he's got some talent. But he's got to learn to find the happy medium between being aggressive and then being, you know, a detriment to your team at all times. So we'll see what happens. But, you know, like I said, I'm, I'm rooting for the kid. I think he'll figure it out. But when you quit on a team and your old man's coaching, that's uh, that's never a good sign. So we'll see how, how everything works out. Anyway, that's on this episode of the Power Play of Siege on what the New Jersey Devils should do with Stefan Matteau. Stay tuned for more episodes throughout the season and beyond. Later, guys.